We are at the Stockholm Philanthropy Conference, which is just a wonderful, great opportunity to meet folks from all across Sweden and other parts of the world who are involved in philanthropy. Future philanthropists should think, what is the cause that I want to address? What do I want to achieve with my donation? Uh, how can I also bring maybe my time and my talent into the mix? It's very important to learn from others. And, and even those who have been doing this for decades are learning every day. They have brought together a very accomplished community of the philanthropists, not in just the speakers, but also in the audience. A really interesting mix of Swedish, Scandinavian, and international perspectives about philanthropy all coming together in the same place. I came thinking about here's what I needed to present and I got here and now I have this whole rich new network of friends. Throughout all, all the years that I've been working in Africa and around the world, it's philanthropy that, uh, you know, along with some government money, it's philanthropists who really, really supported the work and become involved. My biggest takeaway was watching the evolution between business, donors who have always been donors, business people who have gone into becoming donors in the philanthropic world, NGOs, coming to a much more sophisticated understanding of what perspectives you have to bring to it to really get government and civil society and business and cooperation. I had not realized how internationally focused Swedish donors are. On the flip side, I was struck by the commonalities between Swedish and American donors with the, the questions of how do we give well, how do we move our money effectively. Philanthropy for me is really finding durable ways of changing so that people have greater access to opportunities to help themselves, to be better and to live to their, their highest potential. Every single one of us makes a difference every single day and we have a choice what kind of difference will we make.